Well, I mean, I think that the, the context of this is the rising salience of the culture wars, which is really being driven by what I would call the rise of cultural socialism yeah. or wokeness. Mm. And that is being driven in schools and universities. And what that's about is equal outcomes for minority groups and also hypersensitivity to the feelings of minority groups. And that sort of means that something like the poppy even, these commemorations where there isn't equal representation in the past, clearly most people who were fighting in the wars were white, mm. that is seen somehow as therefore not equal or, or somehow off-putting to minority communities. Mm. And for the identity left, they're gonna take the side of minority sensitivity, and so this then becomes a division. Yes, it does, because also most of the people that were fighting uh, on the opposite side, certainly in the Second World War and the First World War, were also largely white, weren't they? I mean, there was wars all over the world, obviously, but but by and large, the fighting right. was going on um, in you know white society in Western Europe and uh, the Far East as well.